We are less than a month away from the make and bid mayoral election. Several local organizations took to a different approach on introducing this year's candidates by hosting a virtual mayoral forum. Inslee Nichols breaks down some of the topics discussed by the candidates. The candidates started the night with an introduction. Each candidate had 90 seconds to share thoughts on a wide variety of topics with crime starting off the forum. I want to hire and retain more certified law enforcement officers and do that by going back and looking at our spending and cutting costs. Some of the former officers that we've had, there are many officers that could come back, work part time without the benefits and save the county money. We're going to have to increase salaries up to a point where that's going to be attractive to the best recruits that are out there. Education is the key. Proper education, of course, parent engagement, providing resources to our families. The key is getting jobs and getting training. The education system is the key. The candidates also weighed in on civil liberties at the local level. Some even mentioned the Ahmad Arbery case as an example. We need to do everything in our capability to make sure that we are colorblind, regardless of who is uh, committing a crime, who is trying to find a job. I do think that we need to uh, get behind every effort to uh, take this to Atlanta, to the state capitol, and have a uh, hate crimes law. Most of the time, it's not because it's a hate crime, it's because someone has a mental health issue. And that's what needs to be addressed. Make sure we have the right judges, prosecutors, people in place. And that's exactly what the top elected official of any community set the tone for. Leadership's about pulling everybody together and coming together for common ground. And common ground is exactly what we're looking at in Glenn County. We can find common ground, we can rally the troops, and we can beat this together. To end the night, candidates gave remarks on the coronavirus pandemic and the reopening of Macon Bibb County after discussing topics like business blight and balancing county funds. In Macon, Enza Nichols, 13WMAZ News. To watch the full form, head over to 13WMAZ.com.